humans have <clears throat> did not evolve to do two-dimensional um, uh, uh, communication, right? I mean, essentially, when you get to this, this is a two-dimensional two-dimensional way of understanding things, and so um, we we have evolved our perceptual senses to live in a three-dimensional world, and so by looking at things in a two-dimensional, uh, you know, like on a computer monitor, we're not utilizing all of our senses, even though we can see faces and bodies and whatnot. And so there's something lost, I think, in, the, in, being that from, in doing this from being live. And so it's probably the depth not of perception in many different senses. I do believe that there's probably other things about contextual smells, contextual sounds, that, and then your knowledge of where you're at that, that puts us in a different place of mind so that we can probably understand each other a little better. <clears throat> and so while <clears throat> I think it, uh, this kind of communication allows us to understand each other better than only audio, no question about it, I think there's a lot of meaning and messages lost from face to face because of what we don't have, which starts with our perceptual bases <clears throat> 